Hello, and welcome to Personal Life Coach 2, Touching Tuesday. So today's scripture will touch on Jeremiah 29, 11. For I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord's plans for welfare and not for evil, to give you a future and hope. So as we come to the end of the month of May, I wanted to kind of touch bases when it ties into mental health. And that scripture is very strong for mental health. Hope taps into mental health. And a lot of people sometimes condemn themselves over and over for the past. Look to God. Look for God to heal you, to give you guidance and hope, and to help you work through those thoughts, those feelings, that trauma that maybe you have experienced, shame, guilt. Have some hope. And as you look for hope, because faith is filled with hope. And let's be hopeful as we look to God and we trust to him and our faith guides us. Hope is sometimes running rapidly in neighborhoods where people feel hopeless. They don't feel hopeful and they condemn themselves over and over. Loss of loved ones. We just went through the memorial for the veterans that we've lost that served our country. Some individuals feel helpless for what happened. Look to God, look to Jeremiah 29, 11. Look for hope as you can work through things and you can work through anything through God. Challenge those thoughts of depression, stress, any of those things that tap into anger. Tap into that, give it to God and be hopeful. That is my scripture for you on Touching Tuesday. Um, if you ever need any personal life coaching, send me a message. You can send me a message here on Facebook. You can reach out to me on personal life coach two at gmail.com. Send me an email. Call the business number 951-430-4445. And let's work through things. Work through things with our scriptures. Work through things with God. And let's be hopeful. This is a new month and a new day. Today is June 1st. And we are moving forward in life and being hopeful. Thank you.